What's going on YouTube? It's your boy New Jersey Finest back with another video. And in today's video, we're going to be doing a quick review of the Lemuro model FK8608. This is a electric shaver. I guess you could say it's in competition with the skull shaver, which I have, but we're going to get into that in a few minutes. Um, basically, I got this because I needed a new, I needed a replacement. So as you can see here, it comes with all these accessories, including the extra set of the rotary blades. It has um, a nose shaver, then it has a trimmer, which I'll show you. Uh, this device right here is like a, it's a brush whatever you would call it for your face to, you know, I guess after you shave, you want to smooth over your face. Well, that's one of those. And the actual device opens up itself. And yes, you can use it for wet and dry. So without further ado, I'm just going to open it up. Oh, here's the device for one. I like the little rubber padding on the side. want to do that now basically to clean it you just pop it open and there you have it and the other side will open up as well yeah, zoom it in so you can see and you just back it was already at a hundred percent as you can see and you charge it right there you charge it plug it right into your computer or USB port that's how you charge it so I'm interested to see how this works so that covers, this is your nose trimmer, like I said, the blade, the trimmer blade. I guess a little like kind of, I don't want to call it a scrub brush, but yeah, that's it. That's a little protective cool, protective cover that it has on it if it looks weird. Clipper guards, and then extra, extra set of blades, which I thought was pretty cool because you know you don't get that with a uh, oh sorry yeah and your little cleaner brush. But like I was saying the extra blades are cool because like skull shaving didn't give me that. Um, I got a. Extended warranty by scanning the code that came inside, but you'll see all that stuff later. You just want to see how this works, right? So here's the reason why I got had to do a replacement. So if you're familiar with the skull shaver, it comes with the five blades. Then they made this three blade and they made a four blade, which I was going to also get the four blade. So if you don't have a skull shaver and you're interested, I can tell you this one is the Pitbull, Pitbull Gold. Make sure you know which one you're getting when you get it because the Eagle isn't as good. Like if you have um, coarse hair or curly hair, the Pitbull is better. The Platinum is the best. Um, this, as you can see, is the three blade. Like I said, I was going to get the four blade. The reason why they had to make something like this, in my opinion, because the five blade that you see advertised does not open up. So if you try to open it up to clean it, you void the warranty. These, however, 
you can pop it right off. And then this piece, you, you turn and it comes off and then you can clean the excess hair and everything. And like you can see, I use this one. So you see all the hair in here, which I'm going to get rid of. Dab, 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 dab. And we just rinse it out. And that's it. The top part, I just, just going to like that, just to show you. Get the hair out now. Here's the reason why I had to get another one. Again, it's a great device when it works. However, mine hasn't been submerged underwater. It has not been dropped. And then I started experience, experiencing this problem with the fire blade that it came with. See how it's struggling? And I still have 75% juice. This is probably the most consistent it's been earlier during the week. The thing barely would, uh, would work. So this right now, I could shave with it like this, but it doesn't stay like this. It constantly gets weaker. It's actually getting stronger while I'm recording, but no. It's, it's phenomenal when it cuts. And with the fact that you can, you know, now empty the mount, empty the blade out and replace it. Well, not replace it, but rinse it out and uh, use it. Okay, cool. But this again is not. How it, it's supposed to actually sound more consistent than this. Now you see? All right, enough. So I was looking in the market, and then what I did was I needed another, like, T outliner. So I stumbled across the same company. They actually have a cordless set, stainless steel, and it's a trimmer, and it's a T outliner, which I'll show you the T outliner now because I carry it. In my case with me, this is the T-Outliner. And you can see it's the same company, stainless steel. Charge it right there. And with the clippers and the trimmers, you can actually use it while it's plugged in. So it's not like when you plug, when it's plugged in, it doesn't give power, you can still use it, which I thought was cool, but I haven't used the, the clippers yet. I just use this, I use this a lot, and I really like it. Blue light, that's good. So you know it has pretty good power because it's not taking batteries. You know, re replaceable batteries or anything like that. And just so you can see, here is the clipper set, which, this was all purchased on Amazon. So, I'll show you the clippers. And here's the clippers. Everything like your traditional clippers. Stainless steel handle, stainless steel work, and a small LCD screen. And what's cool about the LCD screen, as far as showing you the battery and everything, it also has an oil indicator. So when you need oil, the clippers will let you know. Cool. And as far as cleaning, I use this stuff a lot. It's a five in one. So if you're not familiar with it, it's a coolant, disinfectant, lubricant, cleaner, and rust preventative. I've been using this for a very long time and I stand by it. Now, without further ado, I'm going to take this and we're going to shave this mug. All right. So again, one handed style. We just want to see how it's going to fit. So I'm going to switch my camera so you can see close the hair that I have on my face. Okay, here we go. So you can see, yeah, there's definitely some hair I need to shave as far as my dome. Yeah, we need to shave it. So we're going to just give it a once over to see. You don't have to worry. I'm not going to sit here and make you watch me shave my whole head, whole face. We're just going to go up under here. 
And then we're going to do this and we're going to do some of my hits so we can actually see how this thing works. So first, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the trimmer on here and go up under here and see how it works. Be right back. So we got it all set up. We're going to give the trimmers a little spray. There we go. All right. So let's take a look. Sounds like it's catching here. Yeah, it's catching the most part. some hair on there let's cut it yeah I can say that it, uh, it definitely took some the hair off here now for this and this I'm going to switch it back to the rotary blades but yeah that's pretty good and we're back so we have this on and we're going to give it a shot then. 90% so far. Let's give it a shot. Oh, yeah, I like that so far. Yeah. Again, you don't want to push down on these type of devices. Just put it to your face, let it do its job. Circular motions. You know, I usually go the opposite way, I go against the hair. With the hair rather, and then I'll go against the hair. And yeah, I like it. Now what I'm gonna do is go around the mustache. I'm not gonna take the whole thing off. I'm gonna just try to go around it. Because I'll use the trimmers to do this later. And, and it, like I can see it definitely cuts like the way I'm using the hair. I can feel it still cutting, but I'm not cutting that hair that I want to keep. So let's go on to the side here. And you see, try to get a good angle where you can see this definite hair here. See here, it doesn't look like it, but this here, all up here. We're oh, gonna do this. You can hear the hair being cut, so this way at least you know. Yeah, no pressure. I'm just going around. I do kind of wish, okay, I can hold it like this. I saw you hold the skull shaver, which makes it real easy, but I have big hands. So I can still do it like this. So let's just do it. Try to do a halfway point. I can already see the difference if I'm doing a halfway point. Definitely. Plus, I know you can hear it cutting. Now, 
I think that's about it I'm gonna do right now. 94%, not bad. Now, you should be able to see, even with the light on, there's a line here. Where you can clearly see I shaved this side. This side, I didn't shave. You can still see kind of a five o'clock shadow here. But on this side, you don't see it. So, it does work. I like it. Very good investment. I watched all of, I looked at all the reviews before purchasing it. And it seems to be a great replacement for the dying skull shaver. Now, I'm going to keep it, I guess, until it kicks the bucket because I don't have a warranty on this no more. But again, like I said, this is a really good device when it works. And again, make sure you know the difference between the Eagle, Pitbull, and the Platinum. Platinum is a whole different color. But this one was great. It's just that the five blade that it comes with. You cannot open unless they change them where you can open them. You can't open them. So all you could do is rinse it in the, either in the sink or the device they, the, you know, the, the tool that it came with where you could put it on here and you can uh, let it sit, but you can't open it. These, however, you can open, you can remove the blades, you can replace the blades on the three and the four. So if they made a five that you could do it for, let me know in the comments, but unless I get another, you know, power head, this one. is going. Skull Shaver, if you're out there and you happen to see this video, I do like this device, but I don't like this. Again, it wasn't dropped. It's never been dropped. I've had about roughly about a year. I never submerged this whole thing in water. It sounds like the mold, but it's just starting to stress. And I don't have a lot of hair, so I know it's not that. It's just, I don't know. Let me know, but this, for the amount I paid for, is a phenomenal replacement. Now, let's talk about the price. The Skull Shaver Gold was, you can look it up. I know it was about maybe a hundred, something like that. I forgot. It was It was a while ago. Um, but this on Amazon, they give you a coupon after taxes. I paid $36 in change. Okay. $36 for the change for this. And it has all the attachments that I showed you. The nose trimmer, the hair, the face, um, brush, um, the nose clipper. It comes with the, the trimmer comes with two guards. And um, the brush and a replacement set of these for under $37. So this is a great investment. If you want to go, you need to shave, take it, handle your business. You at work and you want to just charge it up. You want to keep it at 100% or whatever the case is. You use it for a couple of days. And then you say to yourself, oh, I know I need to charge it. And you're at work or wherever you're doing, plug it in your USB in your car, your tablet, your work, your desktop computer. Let it charge up. Take it off. It comes with a nice little bag that you can put it in, which, you know, it's a little added bonus. But again, this is a great product. You won't be disappointed with it. This is my review. Your boy, New Jersey Finest. Till the next time, everybody be safe.